Welcome, this is your Option Monster Volatility Sonar Report. From the floor of the SIBO, this is Jamie Tyrrell of Group 1 Trading. Well, the settlement for July came out in VIX and it was 1676, a very quiet settlement right about where it would be expected to open after the uh, cash and future went out the day before just below there and the market was down very small. So in all in all, a very uh, smooth settlement for the VIX crowd. A little bit less activity in the S&P 500 than we've come to expect on recent prints, but still a very reasonable number. In August, there's been just a slew of trading so far today. And what we're seeing is skew trades in August. Essentially, the paper's coming in buying far upside August calls. The biggest such trade, the August 23, 28 call stupid. Customer coming in buying 26,000 of each strike, buying the call stupid, paying $1.55. Another customer came in and bought the August 50 calls, paying 10 cents for those. August 50 calls are almost 200% out of the money right now, so really a very high strike trading there. But it's not as if they're just concerned about the upside and think that it's inevitable that we pop up in August. To go against the upside purchases, which protect them in the event of the crash, these customers are looking to sell a huge amount of at-the-money August options. So they're selling the 19 puts, selling the 16 straddle, selling the 21 calls, just a ton of August options being sold. The 19 straddle trading, $4. <clears throat> So what it seems to me is the customers are protecting themselves in the event of a crash, which they place at a likelihood of pretty low, 10%, 15%, somewhere low. But they're also selling the, at the monies because they believe that the most likely outcome is a quiet month and a steady VIX. An interesting strategy, buying the upside calls, selling the at the monies. It's really popped VIX skew to very high levels. So out of the money calls are very in demand and at the money options, no one's really bid on them right here. This is Jamie Tyrrell with Group 1, Option Monster.